Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. So today we are going to be diving into the beloved Blue Blood Palette by Jeffree Star Cosmetics. It is kind of an older palette, but I was like, I don't care. I still want to do a review. So we are going to be doing this eye look today, and I'm just going to recreate it on the other side with you guys. So first I'm going to go in the shade with Mint tea which is kind of like a pastel mint color like i know mint is already like kind of pastel but this is like even lighter than normal mint and i'm just going to apply it all here a little bit more on the brush this eye look is super quick super easy Compared to what I normally do, which takes me hours and hours and hours. Okay. So there it is. As you guys can tell, it's kind of a pastel. Like, on camera, it's looking more like pastel baby blue. But it isn't baby blue. Next, I'm going to go in with I'm Cold, which is a baby blue. I'm just going to kind of apply it here. I don't want to apply it too far up because I do want some of that mint tea shade to be shown. I'm going to kind of like darken up the crease area. <laughs> I guess while I'm doing this, I can start talking to you guys about some other stuff I want to talk about. Okay, so there's that. I don't know if you guys can really see that I like darkened it. It is. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with the shade Blue Blood. Well, I'm going in with the shade Blue Blood. I just want to talk about Jeffree Star and Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Jeffree Star on his Instagram story yesterday said that he was getting his nails done for a new campaign. Do I think this is a new eyeshadow palette coming? No. Because I am pretty sure that he's already done his campaign photo shoot for this next collection that he's coming out with. So what I think he's, his new campaign is going to be is for the new formula for skincare that's coming out in May. So I believe that's what it's for, but I could be wrong. But I'm pretty sure that's what it's for. Um... Also, I did receive a video from a friend of a swatch of Jeffrey's highlighter, Money Honey, with a swatch next to it of Voodoo Glass, which is one of his eye glosses. And they looked almost identical. I want to say that my friend said the highlighter was actually more pigmented than the eye gloss. Next, I'm going to go in the shade Deceased to really darken in the crease. Now, I am just going to go in with the same minty shade and kind of lighten this area just a little bit. Okay. Next, I am going to cut the crease, so I will be right back. Okay, so now I have cut the crease Undertaker, which is this one right here. Gosh, it is super windy outside today. Sorry if you guys can hear the wind. Okay, I'm just going to apply it. Kind of pack it on. I don't want to blend it out too much. I don't want it to be as dark as possible. Okay, so that shade is on. It kind of looks black, but in person it's more of like a dark navy color. Super pretty. Next, I'm going to go in with the shade Blue Monday, which is kind of like a neon indigo color. This one right there. It's not going to be like super thick just because I need space to do the, the shimmer. I'm going to go in with this brush. And the shimmer shade I'm going to be using is Colonin. 
this one right here, which is kind of like a white that has like some blue reflex. And then on top of that, I'm going to go in with, what is this? Crystal Flesh, which is this one. Okay, there's the colon. I don't think I'm saying that right. I'm not sure how to say it. Okay. And then I'm going to go in with the Crystal Flesh. You move to the bottom. Which, first, I'm going to take whatever's left on my brush from doing the dark shades. And I am going to go all, like, directly underneath. I should say where my lower lash line is. I am just going to add a little bit. don't want too much. Okay. And then I'm going to go in with a fluffy brush. Which I'm going to add a little bit of the minty shade and then the I'm cold shade and then the blue blood shade. I'm going to knock all of that off because I don't want a whole lot of pigment. Do mascara, do lashes, all that fun stuff. So I will be right back. Hi guys, future me here. Um, After I've gotten all my makeup off and all that, I'm sure I still have a little bit, but it is what it is. I just thought about something. So like, I'm trying to figure out like what other like skincare jeffrey's gonna have i don't know if it's gonna be like i know he said new formula but i don't know if that's gonna mean like for different skin types you know um but that would be nice if he does something like that because you know some people are, are very dry some people are very oily you know some people are a combination you know some people have acne and you know all that so there's different scenarios so i'm just curious to like know if he's gonna try to do different skin types or like what this new formula is gonna be what it's gonna look like is it gonna have the same scent who knows but yes this is just a little note from future self okay guys this is my finished look i think for my lips i'm going to do the shade Ooh. weirdo breakfast at tiffany's and the what is this heaven's gate gloss to kind of bringing more of that blue, dark, you know, pearly aspect of this makeup look. So I will be right back with my lips done and my wig, all that fun stuff on. So I'll be right back. Hey guys, so this is the finished look. I really do think that this lip shade goes good with the eyes. This wig on the other hand, mm, I think it's a little too bright, but you know what? It is what it is, but yeah, and it's quite thick too. I know that I used this for a MySpace look and it kind of messed it up a little bit, but it's okay. But yeah, also I just wanted to mention that I just realized what today is. Today is Sunday, Easter Sunday. So happy Easter, everyone. I totally forgot that today's Easter. Well, I guess you could say that this pink and the pastel goes with Easter. But yes, other than that, that is it for this video. Let me know in the comments, you know, what you think of this look. Would you wear this look just because, you know, I think this is more of like a now, a, you know, t like a today look, you know, more than a back then look when you would wear something like this and everybody would be like, whoa. But now I just feel like all different types of makeup, makeups are very accepting. Oh my gosh, I cannot talk today. Yes, this is it guys. I will see you guys next video. Bye.